Good morning, it's your friendly neighborhood Bullseye AG bringing you today the pre-alpha tech test of Titanfall 2 that we had over this past weekend. I uh, actually was pleasantly surprised with this game. I had a lot of fun with it. Um, the graphics are good, the gunplay was good. Of course, what, the, what everybody really wants to know about this is how did it feel and it was smooth. It really was. Uh, there was a good pace to it. It seemed fast when it needed to be. You could slow it down as needed also. Um, the you know some of the complaints in the past were depth and the clunkiness of the mechs uh, that actually felt a little better in terms of the mechs it didn't feel as clunky to me but overall I really just enjoyed the the smoothness of the game As you can see here it's just seamless running around you got your double jump your slide run on the walls which you don't even have to worry about just get next to them it does it yourself and various things depending on how you set up your character now as far as depth goes, can't really speak a whole lot to that right now because the game's not out. It was just a tech test. Uh, if it's based off, if the actual multiplayer is going to be pretty much the same as what we saw with just more maps, then I would say that there's not a lot of depth to this game because there's not a lot of weapon selection or add-ons or anything like that. And I hope that's something that's really just, you know wasn't important or needed for them to do this test and they're going to change that later on because it is one of the fun things that is in a multiplayer game um and this point kind of points out this is one of the spawn buildings and that's one thing i want to bring up too that i really did feel like they did a good job of making it where you don't get spawn camp too bad this is my personal feeling now again it's very limited in the maps that we had it was just a test so there could be some bad map design later on but overall it was pretty good um I found myself getting really comfortable with the standard assault rifle, which is kind of sad. It's the way a lot of the twitchier games go these days. I, I mean, this past year I've only played Battlefield and Rainbow Six Siege, which are slower, more tactical. Battlefield, of course, a lot closer to actual, actual real-life physics with guns. Versus this, I mean, I didn't feel like I had to do any leading or anything uh, as far as an assault rifle and the didn't feel like there was any drop off with range either so almost makes a sniper rifle uh, null and void and but I mean that's no different than kind of like your COD style which I, I you know I believe the makers of this game were involved with the original Modern Warfare 4 so that does make sense that has that sort of feel and taking it into the future with that and um also, with the characters that you create, I mainly just uh, dealt with the grappling hook and the knife. The knife is kind of fun. You can do the whole like one-hit kill thing with it, plus it has a sonar. But I had a, I had fun with the grappling hook. I took that, plus an ability that allows you for it to recharge faster. Felt like Spider-Man, man. I mean, just going around. I was using the knife in this video, but in general, I played with that grappling hook. It's just a lot of fun, especially when it recharges fast. And you can pull people to you which is fun. Now, one of the other gripes in the old game was the AI. Uh, when, like when you're playing with the bots, that they're just way too easy. I don't feel like that's changed. There's a mode Bounty Hunter where you get to play with player versus player and mechs, uh, your titans, I mean, and there were some grunts and they still just felt like exactly like that grunts. Just cannon fodder. A uh, good way to get used to your new weapon or get used to the feel of the sniper rifle, whatever, but definitely nothing uh, difficult to deal with. Uh, I think they even had some AI small uh, titans, and you know, those were a piece of cake to, to burn through, too. And then, of course, a um, standard mode for uh, the titans and, and, and all. But they do have that player versus player, which is what you're seeing just straight up. Uh, a lot of fun enjoyable and once again I just have to say it was very smooth I didn't notice any lag uh, hiccups you know problems I'm sure there's gonna be glitches found in the game but I was it was a really good fun experience and I might have to check it out when it comes out in uh, October so anyway hope you enjoy uh, let me know what you think like and subscribe leave some comments if you want to I hope you have a good day and I'll see you later